If you're one of the millions who play Genshin Impact regularly, you might know Diluc as a brooding and mysterious but tender nobleman with fiery attacks. Game-wise, he's a powerful character who can get even stronger if you get him the right stuff and enhancements. If you're looking to add him to your team, here's what you need to know. Unfortunately, Diluc isn't one of the few characters you unlock while playing through Genshin Story Mode. Instead, you'll have to unlock him like you unlock most other Genshin characters, through the gotcha system. To do this, you'll need to be far enough along the prologue to unlock the shop and wish menus. If you've managed to do so, we can start. As of recording, you can get him via the Wanderlust Invocation Banner, a standard wish banner that thankfully doesn't expire. To wish upon the banner, you'll need a Quaint Faint, which can be bought using 160 Primo Gems, 75 Stardust, or 5 Star Glitter from the shop under Payments Bargains. You've got a 0.3% chance to land a 5-star character or item, with a 1 in 15 chance of it being Diluc. Feel free to buy as many Fates as you think you might need. Once you're satisfied, go back to the main menu and click on the Wish tile. Using the tabs at the top, click to the Wonderlust Invocation banner, then look for the Wish buttons at the bottom right. You'll be given the option to roll multiple times at once depending on the banner. If you have insufficient Fates to make a Wish, you'll be prompted to obtain more. Click on your desired wish, and depending on which banner you've wished on, the game will then give you an item or character at random. Whether or not you get Diluc is determined totally by luck. There's a slight reprieve for players though. You're guaranteed a 4-star character or item every 10 rolls, while you're guaranteed a 5-star character or item every 90 rolls, with your chances going up substantially on your 76th. This is tracked by the type of fate you've used to roll for the banner. If you rolled 9 times using Intertwined Fate with no luck, the next time you use an Intertwined Fate to roll, you'll get a 4 or 5 star item or character for sure. If you run out of fates, there's no need to worry. You can always buy more using Primo Gems, which are found all throughout the game's world and are awarded by completing quests and obtaining achievements in-game, though the option to top them up through microtransactions exist if you don't want to play and wait. Certain characters can also be occasionally purchased using other forms of earned in-game currency, like Star Glitter under their respective exchanges, and be obtained through in-world events found using your events menu. It's best to keep your eyes peeled, lest you let your chance of getting Diluc slip away. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Genshin Impact and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.